So on Monday we have a morning assembly, and what we do is we say the national, we sing the national anthem and do the acknowledgement of country. And when we go in classroom, we do homework first, and then we're working on a new spelling program, and then we have specialists with which is Spanish Performing Arts PE, Arts and Library. We also have CEL, so it stands for Social and Emotional Learning. And we also have topic for, we subtitle our project. Yes, and topic is base, basically um, where you base, you kind of have a topic that you have to work on with your class. Friday assembly, um, sometimes classes present and we do um, school song and also we do student of the week. Par your parents are allowed to come to the assembly on Monday and Friday and um, they can um, video and watch you um, present to your uh, um, to the school. Um, do the annulment uh, <laughs> Acknowledgement of country every Monday morning and help run the assemblies and do the awards, the announcements and introductions. Sport captains help out at school sports and the arts captains help out with the school production and more. The role of the junior school council is to help improve the school and create fundraisers. Um, if you're the youngest, then the eldest will get a note first before, you, and they will always get a note. And also, there is also Central, which um, allows the school and your teachers to send messages to your parents, and it tells them it what. Um, sometimes you might have. Um, forgotten to email the school why your child isn't at school so um, they will just give you a notice or a call and you can also um, they're also that's where you get your reports um, from your class and then your parents can see your results and all the work that you've been working hard for. And also on Flexi School you will have um, reminders from school and stuff so that you could um, remember that sometimes you have curriculum or something yeah and at the moment we've also been using Google Classroom which is basically where your children do their online working but also there would be things also for your parents so then they can look and especially and now we are having a like a parent teacher interview that will be on the Google Classroom and we also have Facebook and then we sometimes do reminders on there and then we have kids doing some things on there. And we also have the school website which is um, this, um, our school made a website for the parents to see like um, what has been going on at the school and the pictures around the school probably like maybe also sometimes if you're new you can look around and you can actually see the pictures of the school and the classrooms and we also have assemblies which um all the teachers will tell us about reminders or some things we'll do from for next week or when we're not going to be here <laughs> social emotional learning and we learn about how emotions how um, emotions and how to interact with others and also we learn about character strengths and these are some examples like perseverance bravery and gratitude we also learn about zones of regulation and in our class what we do is we have a little chart of the blue zone, green zone, yellow zone and red zone and every morning when we come into the classroom we put stick our names on which zone we are feeling to start off the day of school. Also we do um, emotional literacy and we understand and we express our emotions to people which we understand. Respect, respectful relationships 
is basically when you respect everyone's differences um like if they have if they come from a different country if their family is different or like the skin tone of their skin and it doesn't matter how they look you just have to respect everyone of their differences because you've got differences too and every, um our our community wouldn't like it if everyone was bullying each other of their differences this serve voice and give is when we learn about the community and how we can give back to the people who are kind. Principals know us and they call us nicknames. For example, Kevin calls me um, Liam Chelly. Um, another reason is that recess and lunch, um, you have a lot of options to entertain yourself uh, such as the playground the soccer pitch in the oval also the obstacle course and the gaga pit our school has um courts to play sport at we have um a couple of tennis courts and two basketball courts the, our library has more than 22,000 books. That all teachers are kind and you, you can do anything, you can make friends and they're very nice. The Jane North Primary School is the best place you could be. Um, I think the best thing about the Jane North Primary School is that you get to learn new things and that like you can make new friends and like you can like know about them and then you might um, tell me what what you know too and that you have lots of fun with your new friends and you can also like like do like different types of activities with them and I love learning here. Like playing outside and learning things. And also it's a great place to be. Thank you.